so hi there folks in this another video for science technology and society we're going to talk about the role of science and technology in nation building in particular we're going to talk about the brief historical background of science and technology here in the philippines and we're going to divide them into three periods namely the pre-colonial period the colonial period so when you say colonial so talking about um, again, we are one, was one of the colony of Spain and the Americans. And we will also talk about the post colonial period um, very briefly here. So let's start off with the pre colonial period this time. Um, even before Spain colonized us, okay, some indigenous science and technology has already existed here, okay, uh, like farming, animal raising, and the utilization of plants and herbs as medicines that is under the agriculture. The use of technology is evident in handicrafts, pottery, weaving, and tools used by ancient Filipinos in their everyday lives. So you can see that science and technology are really existing even before um, the colonial period. Innovation and ingenuity were unmistakable by the way of native Filipinos built the rice terraces. You remember one of the seven wonders of the world or was one of the seven wonders of the world, but now we rice terraces. They use their hands. To, to make those and they also develop tools for planting hunting cooking fishing and also fighting enemies during tribal conflicts the ancient practices in science and technology by our ancestors are now considered as indigenous science or what we call the folk sciences now that's for the pre-colonial period let's move on to the colonial period spanish colonization paved way to modern means of construction okay and we know that because they they're bringing technology Way from, uh, way from Europe, roads, bridges, churches, and other large infrastructures were built with more sophistication using some engineering skills and tools brought by the Spaniards. In addition, Spanish colonizers developed the health and educational system of the Philippines. The American col colonial, after the, sp the Spanish, the American colonial rule modernized almost all aspects of life. In our country they established the bureau of science to, to initiate development in the field of science and technology so um, though we are colonies by these countries there will always be a good side of it okay especially in science and technology now let's move on to the post-colonial period after achieving independence from the colonial masters shall we say the philippines under different administrations continued to pursue programs in science and technology each leadership had its own science and technology agenda. However, it is important to note that some Philippine presidents introduced more developments in the field than the others. And we're going to talk about these um, some, okay? These uh, some Filipino presidents who introduced the developments in science and technology after this video, okay? So that's it for the brief background for science and technology. In the Philippines, let's have a quick wrap, out, wrap up of them. So we have first the pre-colonial period. We have talked about the colonial period under, under the Spanish and American rule. This is before them by the prefix pre. And we have the post-colonial. That is, we have achieved independence already. And um, we were going to talk about the post-colonial period, which is the one we're enjoying now um, after this video. So this will be the end of this video, a short one. For the brief historical background of science and technology in the philippines so in the next video we're going to talk about more about these certain philippine presidents who brought forth and developed okay further develop, develop shall we say the science and technology in the philippines and that's it for this video this is quite short but um don't worry we're going to have more of this okay so don't forget to like uh, or click that like button there and um don't forget to subscribe to my channel and that will be all for this video thank you very much for watching and see you soon okay bye